up YouTube? It's your girl Nicole and welcome back to my channel. I know at one point I thought y'all would never see me again. So the feeling is mutual. Yes, I have been going for a very, very long time. Hi. Boom, here I am with my uh <laughs> so they just they do come to my mid thigh. They don't come that long though. I braided my hair, I did the rubber band method. If you would like to see how it took me four days of my life. <clears throat> no, not even exaggerating to get these bad boys done. Stay tuned. And again, I am still not a professional. I just be doing shit. But we gonna get into the video. Okay, let's go. to go out of a thousand. It's currently four o'clock and here we are. Um, let's see if you guys can see. Am I my setup? Yeah. So join me. I'm going to show you how I do um, one of them. <laughs> and <laughs> then you're on your own. <laughs> They go down to to the bottom. Um, what do I think of this method? It's tight. I can say I am glad I did the back ones first so I could get used to the weight. Um, depending on the color of your hair and your grip game, you will see the rubber band. But I can see the rubber bands. Um, if you like, roll up on me real close like this, you're gonna see them too, but if you're like this far back, you know, you might see something glistening in the sun, but just mind your business. Anyway, we're gonna get started, shall we? Yeah, let's do it. Okay, so I already put my hair in rubber bands, as you can see. Here I am. I know some of them are gigantic. And I'm gonna take this one right here and kind of just loosen the rubber band just a little bit. Um, one tip, don't put on the rubber band too tight. Even if you don't think it's that tight, make it at least one looser because once you put on the rubber bands around it, your scalp is gonna be pulled, okay? <laughs> you don't want your edges snatched off, okay? You want them snatched but not off, okay? So there's a difference, you know? Moving right along. You're gonna take your crochet needle mm -hmm. and pull it through like so like that. And then you're gonna take some hair. I don't know, y'all. I just been pulling, like pinching it. Once you do that, pull the rubber band. A little bit more tight so it could be a little bit more up there this is called the anchor method blend your hair as best as you can I've been using shine and jam next you're gonna take a semi thicker strand of hair to then wrap around I can't see this probably not I can barely see this but you're gonna take it and I'll go under you're gonna wrap it around that rubber band and then start braiding it. Then you're gonna do the feed in method and just add some more hair. And then by then, your braid should be in. Can y'all see that one? I don't know if y'all can see that, but it's fine. Then you're gonna just continue down. The pipeline, try not to twist the braid because your braid will look twisted, okay? Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so this is the final look. These are my braids. They come down to half my thigh. They took forever, okay? They took all day. Um, would I recommend this method? Yes, with patience. With patience, with determination, um, finger strength. Thanks again for watching this video. For the neck of Gotta make sure. Yeah. <laughs>